Hey, good afternoon, TikTok. It is Tuesday, Tidbit Tuesday. Um, here, and we're going to do another Bible scripture today. It's another very, very familiar passage of scripture. Um, 2 Timothy 1 and 7, which says, God did not give us a spirit of timidity, but a spirit of power, of love, and self-discipline. Now, we all quote the King James Version, which says, God did not give us the spirit of fear, but of power, of love, and a sound mind. God has given us all the tools that we need to cope with the trials and tribulations of life. We just have to learn how to use them properly and not let the enemy overwhelm us and distract us to where we cannot utilize these tools. So what are they? God has not God has not given us a spirit of fear. The enemy likes to use fear against us. But God says in his word, don't be anxious for for anything. We should always seek him. We should always pray about everything before you do it. Before you do anything, make any kind of decision, make any kind of move, you need to seek the face of God first. Because he's going to give you the guidance that you need so you can make the right sound decision in the actions that you're trying to take. Again, God hasn't given, God hasn't given us the spirit of of fear. He doesn't want us to be afraid. I told you yesterday that do not fear is in his word 365 times. That's once for each day of the year. Don't fear. God is with you. Again, he said in his word that he's going to go before you, make the crooked path straight, that you'll go through the fire, but you won't get burned. You won't come out smelling like folk smoke, but you have to get refined. He has to take the impurities out of us he has to keep us on that potter's wheel and work us and mold us and shape us does it feel good no but he gives us his holy ghost power to help us through these things to to convict us to help us remember his word when we do fall into temptation and other types of situations and we're tempted to go the wrong way the holy ghost always comes back and say hey, hey don't do that uh 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 so you got to pay attention. And I love this verse in the Bible that says, you know, we may be perplexed, but God is still with us. We may be going through trials and tribulations. And even though it seems like everything is going on, we got to stay fast. We got to be like that weeble wobble. We might get hit, but we bounce back. We bounce right back up. So, again, God has not given us a spirit of fear but a power, love, and a sound mind. Stay focused on God, and he will bring you through. Have a good day.